Welcome to Adalo's Two Minute Tuesdays. This week we're talking about modals. Modals are really simple screens that pop up, tell you something, and then go away. First we're gonna do is design the modal itself. So I'm gonna go to add screen. We're gonna add a brand new screen. We're gonna give it a name. I'm gonna click on the screen itself and then go to edit styles. And in the background, I'm actually gonna set that to be transparent. That way the screen is invisible. But I'm gonna add a bunch of components on top of the screen. So on a rectangle, a text, that way, when I actually go to this page, whatever screen I just came from will actually be visible behind it where the transparency is. So I'm going to add a couple more buttons to perform whatever actions I want on the screen. Then we're actually going to add the modal link action. So I'm going to click on the image list itself. I'm going to go to the icon and I'm going to link over to that new screen we just created. But the transition, we're going to change from push to modal. This is really key. Next on the actual modal itself. We'll add whatever actions we want and link back. In Adalo, whenever you link back, it actually applies the opposite transition of whatever action came to that screen. Finally, let's take a look at what we actually just built as well as some other use cases. So when I click on the photo, it makes sure I wanna actually delete it before doing it. Another great use case is a confirmation statement, simply telling somebody that more information about what just happened. Next is the edit modal itself. It allows you to make really quick, simple edits of some piece of information. Another more advanced version is the create modal. You have to make sure you only do this with simple creates though, like a quick note. Another one is the bottom card actions. When you click it, it actually fixes from the bottom and you have a couple more actions you can choose from. A variation of that is bottom card information, where it's simply telling you more information on the bottom. Finally, image light box. When I click on that photo, I wanna see a larger version of it. A couple of quick notes on those final versions. So in edit styles, you wanna have it be fixed for the bottom card, that way it's stuck to the bottom. For the image light box, you actually wanna make sure you set the background to be black. And then actually what I've done is I've set the transition on the screen that goes to it to be transition none. That way it instantly happens instead of sliding up from the bottom and sliding down. I'm really excited to see all the modals you all will add to your apps.